What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBASafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA 2K account with max badges and more, visit SportsTMB.com. He has been in the community for years and has hundreds of reviews. Click the first link in the description to get your account today. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back with another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today, yo, we got the super duper mega opal packs. And oh my god, guys, guys, oh god, no. Um, Every single player is in packs, pretty much. Every single opal pretty much everything's in packs like i wish i could pop packs but yeah before we get into it man make sure to smash the like button drop the sub and all that good stuff because oh my god um wow um everything is in packs i don't even know what's gonna go down i don't know what packs are deadlier but whoo these packs are here i, I actually want to see if they have Giannis in packs oh my god Giannis is in packs oh god okay yeah make sure to smash the sub button guys if you're selling mt on twitter Hit me up, bro. My Twitter's at your bugs, but holy crap, we got these crazy, crazy, super duper OP packs. And I want to pop them so bad, but yo, here comes the biggest market crash in 2K history. If you have any of these cards, man, if you didn't sell them off uh, a couple days ago, I would say, before the market did crash, you're going to take a big L, man. You're going to take a huge L. Um, This is, man, I, I need MT. I have no MT. Um, I'm actually about to show you what's going on with my team bro my team's about to be worth nothing we're about to go over this whole entire auction house we're gonna decipher everything what you guys should be doing right now to make mt and all that good stuff so in my opinion what are the best packs to pop honestly this one's pretty good because it has t-max shack lamar odom this is probably the best one carmelo's expensive granger bowl yeah this one's pretty good too but then again, this one has LeBron, this one has KD, this one has Luka. This one's really good. Perzingis, Blake, Taco. This one's really Ben Simmons too. All right, so yeah, these and Giannis. Oh, wow, okay. These packs are super duper juiced. Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. So I don't know what you guys... I'm so confused. So they just dropped the Mega Opal cheese, cheesy pack. So what you guys should be doing to make a lot of MT right now? We're going to go everything in this video because there's so much you could be doing to make thousands of MT. You could be flipping cards like crazy. First off, I'm going to say this right now, man. The pink diamond filter is about to go berserk because there's so many of those pink diamonds in the packs, man. There's pretty much every single card in the pack. I personally think, man, every single filter in the game is going to go off, especially the pink diamond filter. There's so many pink diamonds in the packs. Some pink diamonds I would definitely recommend you guys do try to snipe, man. Dino Raja, Shaquille O'Neal, Ralph Sampson, Dennis Rodman, Pete Maravich, um, Alonzo Mourning. Pretty much, bro, every single pink diamond. If you can find a set, maybe a fan favorite. It's Manu Bowles even impacts. Oh, wow. Okay, guys. I don't even know what to say anymore. Pretty much every single card is in packs. What is this going to do to the auction? It's going to absolutely destroy the auction. Like literally completely destroy the auction bro it's the only thing about these packs i feel this sucks is that the diamonds are really really not worth it like the only problem with these packs if you don't pull an opal you're not gonna make mt like these diamonds are so garbage and you're not gonna make any mt why do i say this pack's better no uh this pack's pretty good because of the fact that there's really not a lot of diamonds there's not there's a lot of amis which is also an l but this pack's gonna be the best one in my opinion so honestly opal filter if you have the enable card you're gonna make thousands of mt if you bought lynn terry uh trey young you're going to make thousands and thousands and thousands of mt and as you guys can see man draymond green is already a buyout a ton of cards are probably going to switch to buyout chauncey billups steve francis all these cards man they're going to go to buyout so now what should you guys do if you have these cards what should you do what should you do bro i don't want to lose mt it's simply too late, man. You lost. You took the fat L. I'm sorry, man. I told you guys to sell a really long time ago because I knew this day was coming. Now, will the market crash even harder? This is the thing. Personally, yeah. I think it will definitely crash harder. Well, I think 
There's going to be so many snipes. Honestly, what I'm going to do. One snipe filter if you have the MT4. I don't have the MT4 right now, man. Glitched filter, bro. Pink diamond. This filter, yeah, you do have to scroll. But honestly, I think a Giannis will pop up and a LeBron will pop up a lot. Honestly, you could just go point guard glitched. This is going to be the best filter in the game, especially if you have that MT, man. Point guard glitched filter with LeBron, with Giannis, with Jokic. You could honestly cop a ton of these cards. Let me think. We got Magic. We could also do Opal. Pretty much Opal Center is a really good one because every single Opal Center is in the game, man. So, Opal Center, man, refreshed by minimum buyout. This this is a really good method as well. We got Taco. We got Bowl. We got a ton of cards. Let's see if Power Forward's good, too. So, you could literally continuously switch between Center and Power Forward to make thousands of MT. But now, what is a good method, Bugs? How am I going to make MT if I don't have a lot of MT? Well, these packs are actually out for a whole entire week, which is literally insane. Um, I want to pop these. I think I do have a VC sale. For, yeah, bro, 675 KVC for 100 bucks. Like, I'm so tempted, but is it really worth dropping $100? Not really, man. I want to so bags. I want to see the pack odds. I mean, if you guys really want to pop packs, you could. You could also just hit me up for MT on Twitter. But, wow. Um, Right now, man, if you guys really want to make quick MT, I'm going to say the Diamond Filter and Diamond Investments, man. Diamond investments are going to be key for this huge market crash because there's so many diamonds. Kids are going to pull diamonds out of their butt, bro. Every single pack, they're probably going to pull a diamond or better. So diamond filter is going to be the method, man. They're going to pop these boxes. They're going to throw up these diamond filter cards for very cheap. And especially investment-wise, man, you should be balling out in investment-wise. There we go. K-Love. I'm not going to buy that, actually. But it just shows, man. These cards are going to pop up like crazy, and they're going to continue to pop up. You're going to continue to make MT, and every minute there should be a new card popping up as long as you do refresh your maximum bid. So, Diamond Filter, Pink Diamond Filter. Let's go over this one because he's in packs too, man. Pink Diamond Power Forward Moments. I can't believe 2K is doing this, man. They ruined it. They ruined the auction, honestly. I think with this auction being ruined, they're going to have something insane drop. Like, Something has to drop that is literally crazy. Aaron Gordon's back down to 99k, man. You guys can Evo him and make a lot of MT. But oh my goodness, guys. The market crash is here. The biggest market crash of all time. Here it is, man. It's going to continue to crash. I would 110%, man. If you're one of those dudes with millions of MT, you guys better be investing. Because if you don't invest, you have a chance of losing out on thousands of MT. 100k MT you have, 200k MT you have, whatever you have, man, invest in whatever you want. Personally, I like investing in diamonds. Like, I'm going to show you some diamonds that are worth the investment. Eddie Curry, man. Eddie Curry's a really good investment. Uh, let's see. Colonel Lenko, Granger. J.R. Smith might be a good investment. Paul Pierce might be a good investment. Rondo might be a good investment because he's Evo to a pink diamond. Um, let's look at these other dudes. We got Ja Morant, man. He's a beast. Uh... Ben Simmons is a good one. James Harden's a good one because he's still... A lot of people are still doing that set for B-Roy. B-Roy is actually that good. LeBron Diamond's not a bad one. Melo's not a bad one. There's just so many cards that you guys should be investing in, man. I don't know why they have an Emerald Matt Barnes. But that also makes me think, bro. Did they finally put some of the OGs like Udonis has them? They did. So they even put some of these rare cards in here now. How rare is it now? Because uh, if you guys don't know, this dude Donis Haslam was going for crazy amounts of MT. Now his price is finally going to drop. I'm so excited. Everything's going to drop, man. This is going to be the best time to do collector levels, man. Besides heat checks, obviously. Heat checks, I don't know what they're going to do with those. I don't know why they aren't in packs. But yo, all these premium sets, man. And get your collector level done. Make MT. It's right here, man. We, this is our chance to get our collector level up. To the 750 tokens, man. I'm so close. I picked up David Robinson last night. But yeah, man. That's really all we got for the video. Honestly, what you guys should be doing right now is simply just sitting on the auction, regulating prices, seeing what prices drop, what prices are worth to pick up. It's really all up to you, man. Every single card is in packs, so I really can't tell you exactly what to do. Just literally trust your gut. Go invest in any card you want. And I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Stay tuned for more content. Have a good one, guys. Peace.